Well, tonight, police are searching for the person who allegedly stole $1,000 in bowling equipment from a teenager in Central Ohio. Yeah, this actually happened in Reynoldsburg. NBC4's Dan Perlman joins us now in the studio with where this case stands now. Dan? Yeah, well, right now there's some good news and there is some bad news. The case is still active, but the teen tells me he is very grateful for one man's quick thinking. As this cell phone video shows, it's my obsession. It's something Cameron Brocious loves. Bowling is like a huge portion of my life right now. He is a member of the Reynoldsburg High School bowling team, but on Monday morning outside of his Canada Court home, someone broke into his car. I was really upset about it. And amongst the many items stolen, his bowling shoes and those very valuable bowling balls. Those are what I use pretty much every single day that I go to practice, every time that I compete, I use those same three balls. Naturally upset, Cameron's mother put out the word of what happened. She notified the Main Street Played Again Sports of what was stolen. She gave a description and within hours, a man walked in looking to make a sale. Said he had some bowling stuff to sell. I pulled it out, looked at it, looked at the special markings that was on the ball, his initials, and I knew the stuff was his is meaning Cameron. So Chip Tate took the equipment while the seller took off. He left the stuff and asked me to promise him that I would get the stuff back to the owner. And that is exactly what Chip did. The bowling balls are now back home. They're back with Cameron. I'm like really grateful. A teen who is very happy that Chip and the store helped. That was a huge favor that they did for us and I'm, I'm really thrilled about it. Now, I have been in touch with Reynoldsburg Police throughout the day. They are investigating this at 6 o'clock. I'll let you know where they stand on tracking, tracking down the thief. Local for you, Dan Perlman, NBC4. All right, Dan, thank you.